Okay, so our uh, friend and one of the members of our organization, Eric Christopher Ruffin, is charged with terrorism. You know, he was uh, in a protest. He was kind of, I don't know all the details, uh, gathering the protest. Somebody was doing something. Somebody burned down a car or whatever. They're trying to throw the book at him. I don't know the details of, the, of, of what it is, but uh, as a person, um, to person, I want to show him some support. Can you tell me some of what, what, what you know, Boris, about this incident, what happened? Uh, well, I personally don't know much. You have to watch the video in order to uh, learn more about uh, what went on with Eric and his participation in the protests and uh, his role in what was going on. But all I know is he was charged with terrorism charges for participation in a protest that involved thousands of people in which he was only a part of. And so, uh, in my opinion at least, I think it's a very disproportional charge. I think they're trying to make an example out of him, but I think that if the judge is going to be wise, he would understand that this is just a protest. He was participating in a protest that thousands of other people were participating in, and he should, you know, he should be let go yeah. for that. I'm sure he, you know, whatever the case is, he's... I don't want to say that you use the words learn this lesson, but just give the guy a break. You know what I'm saying? Now, the protest, this, that, so on and so forth. Terrorism is too much. So we want to lend him our support. Whatever you can do, we're going to leave his information out there. If you want to reach out to him, if you can help him, want to find out the story. You know, the, as far as I could tell, he's he, right now he's the protester. You know, the George Floyd, the murder, it, it was a very emotional time, but now he's out there fighting terrorism charges while we're all going on with the rest of our lives. Give this guy the necessary support that he needs. We're hoping everything is uh, gonna be fine for Christopher. There was a lot of people out there and pinning it all on him and charging with terrorism charges, that's not that's not fair. Yeah, so. uh, and we're also giving a big shout out to Abby and uh, yeah. Kayla for her, their participation in helping him out and facilitating uh, Trax News, the, uh, you know, uh, to help out, help him out and share his story to the world. So Eric, hang in there. Anybody who want to reach out to Eric, please do so. Try to help him out and it's uh, fight for justice is really what it is.